Hey guys, how's it going? It's your boy Pookie here. Right, in case you didn't notice, I was building a DIY electric longboard. Now this thing is going to kick ass. I thought, you know, it's not something that I'd usually do in one of my videos, but as I'm leaning towards now my channel being more of an engineering side, drone, build it, do, do you know, DIY, do it yourself projects. And for something like this, I, you know, I'm not really the smartest guy in the world, but if I could throw something like this together, I'm sure you guys can too. So my plan is with the video and this series of videos, especially with the DIY project, at the skateboard is I'm going to teach you everything you need to do and what you need to know and what you need to buy to be able to build one of these. So, first thing you're going to need, obviously, a longboard. Now I've got this longboard pretty cheap, I think it was about 35 quid or something like that. So I think that'll probably work out around 45, 50 dollars maybe. Um, let's uh, take a look underneath the board and see what I've done so far. So, one of the first things I do want to point out with this board is I did buy a mount kit, a motor mount kit for this. I'll show you the link of that and what it actually looks like on the uh, eBay link. But all you get is the uh, motor mount, you get the pulley, you get the belt, and you also get uh, nuts and bolts for the wheels. And you also get the sprocket for the back there. Now, you can actually buy a wheel that's already got holes pre-done and you can buy a, a sprocket for it which would be a lot easier than what I did. I had to basically find the center of the uh, sprocket just at the back and I had to basically find the center of this wheel and it's on and being able to mount that center to make sure that it doesn't wobble was pretty difficult. And I've also gone with this motor. Now this is the Turn G Aero Drive. This is the 190 kV so it's got quite a lot of pulling power. When you're buying um, a motor for your electric longboard, you do want something that does have about 9 to 190 kV. Um, it's just so it doesn't put a lot of strain on the motor and it can basically put more torque in the motor, so it definitely can get you up the hill, especially if you're a fat ass like me. I am a bit of a lard ass. Now, to go along with this, obviously, you can't just power this without oh, a little pumpkin. No. Saying hello. No. Hello. Hello. What are you doing up there? Anyway, back to the video. So I went ahead and 3D printed some boxes. Now, here's the box that I 3D printed. Now, this box will house a LiPo battery, but one LiPo battery isn't enough for this motor, so I went ahead and printed two. I've gone ahead and spray painted one of these in a chrome silver so I think that'll look badass on the board so it'll go something like that with the lid I'll switch that on and the good thing about having a 3D printer guys is you, you know there's so many different things that you can do for it I mean if I was to make this project and I didn't have a 3D printer that there would have been a Chinese takeaway box <laughs> it wouldn't have been a nice little package like a printed out here it comes with all the holes already there and the same with the underneath and you just get little tiny screws and just put them in so I'll have two boxes next to each other like that and that'll be roughly where it is so the only things I need to get now for this is a ESC and a transmitter and a receiver now a transmitter receiver is just any kind of like remote control car transmitter receiver that you get for um, a car so it's just the shape of a gun but I want to go with something a little bit more streamlined so I'm still in the process of you know figuring out which one I actually want to buy but I'm sure I'll keep you guys updated on the video and let you know how I'm actually getting on with it but so far so good guys it's definitely coming on well and um, stay tuned for some more updates so I hope you like this video guys if you did like this video don't forget to like share and subscribe Hey, don't forget as well, I've noticed YouTube now. They want me to they want you to bell me. 
So go up in the top corner, click that bell, ring the bell, bell me all day, day and night, just do the thing. <laughs> Alright guys, take care anyway.